Hey guys, vlogging time. No, vlogging time. Um, I'm sorry about my appearance, I just got back from class. But I wanted to tell you about my morning. I started off with the worst morning ever. So my mum was like yelling at me, get out of bed, get out of bed, like she always does. And I was like, okay, whatever. Got out of bed eventually. She's like, I need your help. We've got the car stuck in the mud. Oh god, I'm oh, sorry, I'll just mute this. Um, so... She got her car stuck in the mud. It took forever to get it out. Long story short, we were stuck in the mud for like an hour trying to push the car out. And I fully like bruised my collarbone from like pushing on the car. This may sound like a really lame story, but you'll get it soon. Um, But my mum called my granddad up because he lives around the corner. And he came over. And so he was on the driveway. My bag was on the driveway. Okay, you can see where this is going. But... My bag was on the driveway because my mum was like, bring it over so we can jump in the car and go as soon as we can because we both had appointments and yeah, we missed them both. But anyways, so my granny couldn't help at all. Um, we had to call out the guy at the garage to come and tow us out and my granddad like reversed down the driveway a bit. Um, my bag was way down the driveway. I don't know why he went straight the way back, but anyways, he did. So he ran over my bag and I forgot it was there and I didn't realise until my granddad was like, Shannon, something's under the car. And I was like, oh my god, my bag is in there. You know? My phone, my perfume, my makeup, all of this crap is in my bag, right? So, oh my god, I was like devastated. I almost started crying. I was like, god, my iPhone must be crushed. But thank god it's not. But I'll, I'll, sh I'll do a little mini what's in my bag soon, shall I? Oh my god, it was just... I'm sorry, this is probably like the dumbest vlog, but I really just wanted to tell you. Because it was pretty funny after it all happened. So... I was like, oh my god, just drive forward so I can grab it out. And I look at my bag, and I was like, my phone's okay. And I like went through all my other stuff, and heaps of stuff is broken. My glasses are broken. I'm pretty gutted. Shall I do it? Okay. So, my pencil case. Hey. Yeah, it's not that bad. My pens inside were all broken, though. My natural nymph lipstick is all bent. The whole cap broke, so I'm going to depot it. But I can just get it open. I'm not sure if you can see that big ding in there, like. It opens, so I'm going to depot it. But it actually split it straight down the middle. It's pretty gutted, because this is the only one that isn't melted, so. My glasses case. This is what happens when you run over your bag. God, I'm, like, I should have moved my bag. I didn't even think of it. I'm so stupid. But my glasses, you know, they look all good. Until you go like this. Hey. They're like, should I put them on for you? Cool. <laughs> my drink bottle was completely... Like, it's like all munted. Like, I'm surprised it didn't pop in my bag. I would have been, like, so gutted because all my stuff's in here. Like, my uniform was in here. This is all, like, crushed. But again, this didn't pop either. I was so surprised. My perfume was in there. The actual, like, this thingy is dented. I haven't actually tried to... Let me just... Oh, yeah. It still works. Ooh, it smells good. But the top of it's kind of crashed. My phone is okay. It's a miracle. Like, seriously, iPhone, I love you. How did this not happen? Like, has anyone else's iPhone gone through, like, an amazing experience? Because I've heard of people, like, dropping them in, like, toilets and things, and they still work. But then again, my Nokia 2280 did that. But those were, like, the most amazing, like, drop-proof phones in the world. I wish you could still own one of them without being frowned upon. My highlight is broken. No, I don't really care about that. The actual thing's okay. And there is just generally a whole lot of broken crap in my bag. Um... I had Skittles in my front pocket, and they didn't break. I was pretty stoked. You know, Skittles are amazing. Yesterday I went to the movies. No. Saturday night I went to the movies with my boyfriend. We went and saw Planet of the Apes, and it was really good. But I almost cried so many times, and I pretty much did cry when the huge gorilla died. Um, but there's so much animal cruelty in that movie, and if you know me, you know I cry if a freaking, like, any animal dies. Like, roadkill. I cry for roadkill. Not all the time, but sometimes. But my Skittles were fine. I was pretty stoked, so yay. And then I looked in my lipstick um, PC bit. I need to do a proper what's in my bag on my other channel. I think I'll do it once I clear out my bag a bit. But um, I was pretty stoked. None of my jewellery or anything was bent, apart from one ring. Um, oh. Okay, I take that back. That's a bit bent. This is my sterling silver. My other sterling silver bracelet was literally like, yeah. My mum's got to get it reshaped. I better give her this one too. Um, but my MAC eyeshadow, my, not my MAC eyeshadow, my MAC lipsticks are fine. And I was like, thank God. Because I was freaking out. Like, seriously. 
because it's plain koi and um saint germain and they're like two of my favorite lipsticks and if they broke i would have been devastated so here's that um ring i kind of bent it mostly back into shape it was completely broken before but it's this really pretty one and i'm like because it's my favorite and um by the way went into the chemist today and i got two for five bucks they look almost the same but that one there is more peach and that one's more pink and these are cool these are amazing they're only five bucks they kind of chip quickly without a top coat but for the price whatever like they're way better than the ruby ones so that's all i have to say really and i've got a haul coming i recorded it already i might upload it tomorrow or the next day no probably wednesday wednesday will suit me way better but sneak peek Anyways, I'm going to go now. I think we're going to have to claim insurance on these glasses because that is not cool. Like, WTF. <sighs>